I'm Jordi Sunyer. I'm research professor at IS Global in Barcelona. Our group and myself aim to assess whether daily fluctuations on attention are related with the daily levels of air pollutants. We did a follow-up study among 2,700 children and we did four different assessment of the attention during a year in all these children. So what we found was that daily levels of NO2 and elemental carbon particles are related with the performance of the attentional test among all these children. And the daily level effects were independent of the long-term effects. That means the values that are in the classrooms in a long term. We did a lot of sensitivity analysis and the effects remain. Of course, there could be some limitation in this study, not due to individual variables like sociodemographic variables, because we did comparison within the same children. But for instance, the classroom ventilation or the classroom noise could affect this association, though we adjusted for several variables like temperature and seasonal effects that in part control for these confounders. So the conclusions are that in addition to the chronic effect of air pollution in neurodevelopment, and in particular in attention, we found that daily variations of air pollution in the same children affect their daily performance in attention. What are the implications of this research? That is very important to abate air pollution in a school environment. And in particular of diesel vehicles.